Hey, Steve Zucker, welcome back to Pogue Sioux Channel or Reverb, wherever you might be. Hey, this is a brand new LH600. These are so nice. The ones that I've been getting lately are just incredible. Uh, it's all solid hand carved wood. It's violin voice, like the old Epiphone art shops in the 30s and 40s that were made by European luthiers that were in Chicago, New York area at the time. And uh, I love the 700s too. I love, I even, I even have a 300 that sounds amazing right now. Every guitar is a little bit different, but, but the 600s I've been getting lately sound unbelievable. I'm not making this up. People usually buy them from me and then they email me back a little later and they say, man, it sounds like a four or $5,000 guitar. But with me, you get the exact one. You don't just get one from the pile. And most people really appreciate that. Hey, I want to talk a little bit about um, you know, the guitar ladder system in Cycle 1. Let's just do some free information. If you want Cycle 1, email me at uh, pokesu at gmail.com. And by the way, you know, if I take the time to send you samples of the guitar ladder system and information, at least you could do is say thanks. Some people just ignore me and it just, you know... I don't know, man. It just seems a little weird. But you're not going to make tremendous growth, musically speaking, and wake up your musical ear and learn to improvise and learn to do your own arrangements of chord melody and, and really learn the language of music and learn the 10 different systems of improvisation in a very organic way by just getting samples. Folks, it works. I've sold over 8,600 courses. It's only $1.99. It's thousands of dollars of information. It's very powerful. It's very simple. Because you can't put music in a cute little box. You, you can't... You know, uh, diatonic harmony is only one little itsy beast, little, little bit of the pie, and you can't put music uh, in a box. So I teach the 10 different systems of improvisation in a very organic way to where you, you see the subconscious mind, those seeds kind of blossom. You begin to hear your own musical ideas, you begin to find them on the guitar. Folks, I really have something special here. I've been working on it for 40 years. It works. It's $1.99. It's thousands of dollars. I don't send all the information at once, but you get... Over 240 studies with a video and a chart for each one. You get the secret Horace Hatchet files. You can order at stevesatguitars.com. It really works. You know, if you really want to get to know your musical self and, and make progress in six months or a year that normally would take you six years to 12 years, and that's what other people tell me, just invest in the guitar ladder system. There's nothing like it on the planet. Because I'm 64. Back when I used to take from Joe Pass, he used to say, you don't, get, you don't get very far by always thinking when you're playing music. You can't always be thinking. You have to be listening. And that's what the guitar ladder system does. It teaches you how to hear um, tension and resolution, how to hear how different chords go together and how they're musical and where they can go and how to create different kinds of color. And you get, you get all this information. You begin to just hear your own musical, musical ideas and begin to find them on the guitar. It really, it's a really exciting thing, but you, don't, you bring a little positive faith to the table. I know what I'm doing, folks. You can go to VintageGuitar.com, put in Steve Zook, read the review of my CD. Uh, I know what I'm doing, and I give the universe and God most of the credit, but I've worked my ass off. But the guitar ladder system is a real deal. It really works. So cycle one, you learn how to connect, you know, kind of a, a major seven, diminished minor type thing. And there's no reason to overanalyze this, like I said. It actually gets in the way. But you know, great music is a combination of the 10 different systems of improvisation. If you stay in a box like diatonic harmony only, it gets really boring. You've got to teach your subconscious mind how to improvise using many, many different systems. And I do that in a very organic way without a bunch of theory. So anyway, cycle one. So there's no reason to overanalyze that. I mean, people always go back to diatonic analyzation, and it, it, you know, there's no reason to. You, it, it, it's enough just to know, yeah, major seven, you know, connects diminished seven. You got some common tones, right? Connects minor seven, connects diminished, connects minor, connects seven sharp five, seven sharp five dominant minor nine seven sharp five, major seven diminished, minor seven diminished. You want to kind of pay attention to the common tones, like that common tone, right? Later on in cycle two, we add the shading with the major 13 flat five. I love that chord. Do the same thing here. I can go to minor nine, major 13 flat five, dominant nine. Now I'm just kind of improvising. 
But the important thing you have to understand is, you know, art is different than like learning how to rebuild a car engine or something where it's step one through, you know, 40 or whatever, you know, with a lot of work in between, right? Music is a subtle art. You need to teach the subconscious, not teach the left brain. You don't need a bunch of rules and regulations and formulas. You're not going to be a very creative, artistic person if that's how you learn it. And I've, I've, I've had people send me, you know, samples of their music and some people have some really beautiful stuff and some people I can just sound, I can just tell it's so stiff, it's so thought out, it's just too left brain. The, you know, you need to you need to input great information to get the subconscious release. <clears throat> and I've had that conversation by the way on the phone with Alan Holdsworth years ago when he was using my speed pick marketed by Dunlap along with my Zookies. And Alan and I used to talk on the phone once in a while and he used to talk about the subconscious release. And so that's why it's important in my guitar ladder system, you get, you get over 240 studies, a chart and a video for each study, and they teach you the 10 different systems of improvisation in a very organic, simple way without a bunch of theory to bog you down. But they teach it in a way, <clears throat> excuse me, where your subconscious mind can absorb it and then assimilate that information, start kind of comparing, contrasting. That happens on a subconscious level, by the way. And a lot of people tell me after they've been working the guitar ladder system for a while, all of a sudden they just start playing something and they have no idea where it came from. And that's because you're putting great information and you're learning how not to think. This is a huge point. When I studied with Joe Pass 40 years ago, he used to talk about, you can't always be thinking when you're playing guitar. You have to be listening and hearing. And that's why it's so important to learn these musical sentences of how chords go together because they, they give you that musical tool chest and then your own subconscious mind kind of looks at that like seeds and it starts comparing and contrasting and starts figuring out you know how to actually find your own original music ideas the musical ideas is an exciting thing so again like I said if you we can look at this diatonically but it's there's really not much reason to I mean I can go one chord passing chord two chord pass you know but it doesn't really freaking matter I'm not I'm not saying there's no validity to, to some of these different improvisational systems but what I'm talking about is ear training you need ear training and by learning my chordal studies, you get the ear training. You start hearing where things want to go. You'll start learning how to come up with your own arrangements of chord melody. You'll make it interesting, too, and not so predictable. And you begin to, to actually hear and find your own musical ideas. Folks, this works. My, my suggestion is just bring some positive faith to the table. Don't overthink it because... Uh, you're not going. You're not going to take a quantum leap by just requesting a few samples from me. I need to make the commitment. It's thousands of dollars of material for only one ninety nine. It really works, folks. And for new customers, you can use my system for. I want you to use it for a year. For new customers, you can use my system for a year. And if you don't agree, you've made some huge progress. I'll refund every dime. Anyway, cycle one again. And this exact six hundred is available, and it sounds great. this a little bit. So that's the cycle one of the guitar ladder system, which is a great cycle. Now the very, and there's lots of variations on that that we do too. You learn how to kind of do it here. You know, you learn how to do the, you know, there's just no end. And then what I do is I, I then introduce new play. I, I take all the chordal studies and then take them somewhere different. And, uh, the information, it's, it's like uploading, you know, software into a computer, but it's, it's your subconscious mind, which is extremely powerful. Like cycle two, or sometimes I call it cycle one with the subs, we add the major 13 flat five, which is a great chord, isn't it? Sometimes I'll then go to minor nine. What, you, what most people tell me is when you start working the guitar ladder system, you'll be doing one of my studies and all of a sudden you'll just want to take off somewhere else and that's exactly what I want you to do because it's starting to open up your ear. You're starting to hear possibilities. You're starting to hear, you know, hear chord connections and how that sounds. The, not just one chord, but you'll, like Joe Pass used to talk about, when he plays a chord, he starts hearing all kinds of other stuff. Joe Pass had a hell of a musical ear. It's because he spent time improvising. He spent time getting to know his instrument. He spent time learning musical sentences and that's what the guitar ladder system will do for you. It really works, folks. My advice is don't overthink it. We're not talking 12 grand here. We're talking 199, but it's thousands of dollars of material for 199. It's the real deal. It really works. So one more time, if you want cycle one, send me an email, pokesu at gmail.com. But if you really, I mean, I, I've had people, and I'm not making this, this stuff up, I've had people email me saying, you know, they've always been playing just kind of in one style or whatever, and once they start getting into the guitar ladder system, they just start hearing all kinds of interesting ideas. Sure, it takes a little bit of time, but it's different with everybody. But if you really want to discover your own musical ideas within, invest the 199 in the guitar ladder system. Don't overthink it. It's the real deal. There's nothing even close on the planet. 
and this exact 600 is available, 999. The list is more. This guitar really has a sound. It sounds like something you could pay thousands of dollars for. It hasn't even been played. I probably have it tuned a little low. Available, it sounds beautiful. It sounds like an old Gibson L5, you know, meets like an old Epiphone Deluxe, and it's barely, it hasn't even been played 10 minutes, and it still sounds this good. So, anyway, uh, for samples of the controller system, pokesu at gmail.com. But keep in mind, samples aren't going to get you there. My advice is don't overthink it. Take the positive leap of faith. We're only talking 199. I'm going to let you use it for a whole year. I want you to use it for a year, though. And if you don't agree, you've made a ton of progress. I will refund the whole 199. That's just for new customers. It really works, folks. But yeah, this exact one, this exact 600 is available. I'll throw in four or five guitar ladder systems with it. But yeah, it has a great sound, man. And it just will open up as you play it more, too. I probably have it tuned a little low. Anyway, brand new LH600. You get the exact guitar I'm playing right here, all solid hand carved wood, violin, voice top. It's a lot of guitar for $9.99, a little, so a little bit of shipping, and uh, it's a beauty. All right, folks, take care.